guys, thanks so much for coming in for a video today. I'm gonna to do a really quick video because this is sort of a challenge tag video. I had a meetup recently. We had a meetup with uh, a bunch of resellers. I'm going to um, honor the request of Kathleen Hopperstadt. She is a member of a group that is um, Tanya over at Thrifty Treasures. It's her group and it's called um, Third Coast Resellers. Third Coast Resellers and Beyond, I believe, or yeah, something like that. I'll link it and I'm gonna link uh, Kathleen's channel as well. Anyway, we met up here in Houston. Uh, Deborah came all the way from Austin. We had somebody from Florida. <laughs> Guys, you won't believe who I met today. Hey, it's Deborah with Pinching Paisles. Hi, Zelma. And everywhere else, say hi, y'all. We went to the Goodwill. I missed the outlet, but we're gonna go to the Florida. It was fabulous. There was a lot of people there. So many people that I didn't even get to meet everybody and I regret that. But um, we had fun. We went to the, I didn't get to meet them at the outlet. Not the, it's not an outlet. What is it? Yeah, it's an outlet. It's the, um, I didn't get to the family thrift outlet in time. Saturday is kind of the day that I can't even, I mean, I really have to knock myself out of bed. So I got there about an hour late and I met them up. We met up at the Goodwill and the Goodwill was really, really good. It was small but it was nice and there was a lady there that was giving me prices off the cuff and it was just fabulous. Anyway, uh, Miss Kathleen said for us to do a challenge and to do a video on all the things we picked up thrifting. And I, like I said, only got to go to the Goodwill, so I'm gonna show you everything I picked up. And then she also wants us to get it listed by Saturday, which is tomorrow, so I'm gonna be working really hard. Luckily, it's all t-shirts and one jacket that I got, so let me show them to you. What I got is by Malcolm Moore and um, whoever this guy is, Ryan Lewis. And this is their song, Same Love, little hippie t-shirt there with the tie-dye. Of course, it's that, um, you know, song that was pretty popular a couple of years ago. So I got these. And then the t-shirts, as you may or may not know, are $2.49 at the Goodwill. But with my discount, I got a discount that day. I paid $1.79. Now, this one I've already listed, actually. And it's really cool. I love it. It's by Wild something or the other. And it's got a really bold, beautiful graphic of a tiger there. And then in the back, it's also got sort of lightning or tiger stripes or something. So it's really cool. Oh, and then I got this Chicago Cubs Wrigley Field bleachers t-shirt. So I got uh, this one. This is South by Southwest. And this is by the freecreditreport.com. Apparently a lot of people go, uh, sponsors and corporates and whatnot, go to this festival, which is world renowned actually. And uh, it's actually taking place, I believe, this coming week or something, because it was in the news recently. Again. Anyway, that's really cool. I really liked it. And then here's a vintage Nike. This one is also listed. This is actually a patch embroidered, and it's already got a couple of watchers. I've got junk food that puts out these novelty t-shirts. But it's really cute. It's got the little arch patch here. Not a patch, but a little stamp there. And McDonald's hamburgers, over 100 million. And this is, I guess, the 1955 sign. I got an NYU. These are all in really good condition, guys. This is a champion as well. Very lightweight to ship, so I don't worry too much about that. I list them for about 13 or 14. And oh, look, this one has the slinky on the sleeve too. Isn't that cute? And then I usually wind up with about a $10 profit on these here. And my male mannequin is really easy to, um, to pull shirts on. I think this is a jersey from, ha a soccer jersey, or soccer style jersey, Holland. Really pretty orange and blue. I love I peeked into the or was it no, I think it was when we were taking pictures and I and I told Devin <laughs> I told Devin Tony, Oh I forgot to put some blush on, so I'm gonna go look in the so I ran into the dressing room to put some blush on and I found this just thrown there on the seat and this is by Kate Moss guys. This is Kate Moss for Top Shop. There's the label there. And this is lambskin. It is the most luxurious leather ever. I love it. And then it's got a lot of asymmetrical design elements. For instance, the, the zipper is kind of to the side here. And then it's got zip and it's got little tassel pull sort of on the zipper. And then it's got the same thing on the arms. And uh, then it has sort of a raw edge finish there. So it's not even very, you know, tailored that way. Same thing on the back. It is a little bit higher. Uh, hem in the back. Not only that, but it actually has a peak in the front. So it is the coolest moto jacket ever. I love it. It looks really nice. It's actually a 14 and it fits me except for the arm. So that's why I'm not going to keep it 
you know, as a backup, I'm going to definitely try to sell that. This is also listed on eBay. And again, this is just really, I had Deborah help me look to see if there was any flaws. There was a little stain. We, I cleaned that up. I knew I could clean that up. Just some white, you know, whatever. Probably from hanging out at the thrift store. And then she saw a little like a pinprick back here, but I think it's kind of disappeared already. It might have been where they had maybe a security tag at another thrift store or something. I don't know. But anyway, I wound up paying... She said it was $9.49 for these jackets, so I wound up paying like $7 with my discount. Yeah, for a Kate Moss Topshop leather jacket, and that is listed. So I'm going to list the rest of those t-shirts. I'm going to do another video because I have a huge haul, as you can see behind me. I think you can see those two bags back there. So I'm going to do that haul as well. I'm wearing Western wear today because it is Go Texan Day. We do a big deal here in Houston with our Texan, with our rodeo, and we have a trail ride. People come from all over the country. They literally ride in on uh, wagons and horses, and then that kicks off our two weeks of rodeo, and we've got big stars, and we just do a big deal. So we did it at school as well. This blouse, actually, guys, this is how much of a big deal it is. At Dillard's, they actually have a whole section of Western wear. They usually only put it out during the, the rodeo time, and they have, this is like a $200 blouse, but of course I got it on clearance like a month later for about, uh, I think 40 or something, but I love it. I've had it forever and I wear it every, almost every Go Texan day. I don't always wear it to the rodeo, but I do wear it for Go Texan day. And then I wear this other jacket that I think I've showed you with all the brooches and stuff. You know, my little collection of Texas and Houston and armadillos and so forth. Anyway, I go on and on way too long, don't I? But let me come back later with another video really quickly. Uh, I mean, really shortly, I'll come back with another video. I hope you stay tuned for that. Thank you, Kathleen, for the challenge, for the video. Thank you, Tanya, uh, for putting the, together the, um, the reseller meetup. It was wonderful. We went to Gringo's later to have lunch, and it was just so much fun. It was really fantastic. Great people, met a lot of people, and I just loved it. I really did, and I can't wait for another one. I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.